so here's a quick question what are the things that you would have said no to 10 15 years ago that today it's going to be outrightly yes and what are the things that you would have said yes to 10 to 15 years ago that you will today say no 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 there are things like that and so what changed nothing really changed you changed you changed you grew and that's what the difference in is between then and now so what is true then is still true now you just didn't know it then the principles did not change you grew to know it you grew that's what happened that's what happened to us every day so but we must then realize that there's a difference between aging and growing some people age but do not grow growing is reinventing yourself growing is renewing your mind some people age without growing darkness is simply the absence of light or how else would you define darkness it's not the other way around light is not the absence of darkness darkness is the absence of light because light is greater than darkness darkness is always present turn off the light and you will see it that darkness is always there it's like always the default it's like always the default position of things until light comes in and when light walks through the door comes into the room darkness finds its way out the truth is darkness exists to the degree that light has been let in or darkness is exists in your life to the degree that you've let in light that's what changes that is the difference between darkness and light so the, the the more light you let in the more the less darkness in the room the more light you let in the less darkness in your life many times when my wife and i are in bed at night she likes absolute darkness she likes everywhere to be pitch dark, dark then she can sleep i'm not usually like that i like a little bit of light you know and all of that i can even sleep with music on in my ears but for her it's darkness so we try all we can even when we're sleeping outside the house maybe we're at a hotel somewhere we try all we can we try everything we can to shut out light so that the room is pitch dark and we do everything we block the windows we put some clothes over it and everything just so we can have pitch darkness but guess what but guess what when it's morning i'm the first to know it because i see a ray of light coming through the the, the blinds even though we thought we did a nice good job the previous night we don't know that we did a good we didn't do a good job and until the morning when the light is seeping in through the window blinds that's when we know that we really could not have blocked off every source of light oh yes there's a ray of light coming into your life right now even by listening to this broadcast there is a ray of light coming in light is dispelling darkness is casting darkness out it is the entrance of the word of god that brings light and gives understanding to the simple truth doesn't become true the day you find out it's always been truth it's it's just you who just found out and it never changes identity it's always the truth it's still the truth you're the one who's new to it your knowledge of the truth never changes identity it's always been the truth you're the one who just found out so don't just age without growing as the days go by make sure you are picking up from where you left from from the mistakes of yesterday you can make something profitable from yesterday's mistake for your tomorrow they're not just mistakes of yesterday they are tools in your toolbox to correct your tomorrow they are the wrenches and the spanners and the the the, the, the screwdrivers to fix your tomorrow make sure that you pick yourself up get up and go forward your tomorrow is greater than your yesterday. The, today is the first day of the best days of your life.